Hi, this is Marshy Morgan here, author and trainer. Um, and I do QuickBooks. And I always seem to forget things, especially when it comes to mileage, because I don't do it very often. And I figured if I'm forgetting, maybe somebody else is too. So I hope this helps you out. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to company. That's where mileage is at. And we're going to scroll down there down to the bottom and find inner vehicle mileage. Now, what I want to show you is mileage rates today. Mileage rates, sometimes once a year, we have to go in there and change the rate. So in 2017, the rate changed. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to change that rate. to what it's supposed to be. And it's 0 0.535. And I'm going to say, good to go. OK? So that's the rate. Now, if you do too many, you'll have to go in there and delete the latest one. So like in this case, 2001, I would go in here and I would delete entry. And notice that 2001 disappeared. So if that happens where you have an older version of QuickBooks and you've had several years of mileage, you may have to go in there and delete one so you can add the, the new current year that you're working with. Hope that helps. Chef, uh, Chef Marcy Morgan uh, with m and Biz Solutions, your food manager's training headquarters. But I'm also an author of 13 Interactive Challenges to Self-Discovery, and you can find it on Amazon. Hope this helps, and have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye-bye.